In this video, we will introduce you to the settings and basic operations needed when using DJI RS4 for the first time. Open the DJI RS4 package and take out the objects. For your first use, connect the USB-C port of the battery grip with the provided USB-A to USB-C cable to activate the battery and charger. Activation is completed when the battery indicator lights up. After activation, take out the extended grip tripod, mount it to the battery grip, and unfold the tripod. Take out the gimbal. Insert the battery grip into the gimbal. When you hear a clip sound, toggle the lever clockwise to lock the battery grip. To detach the battery grip, toggle the lever to the unlock position, then press and hold the detach button to detach the battery grip. Make sure to power off the gimbal before mounting the camera. Firstly, move the pan axis lock to the unlock position and rotate 180 degrees. Then lock the pan axis. Move the tilt and roll axis locks to the unlock position respectively. And adjust the position of both axes. Then lock the axes. Attach the upper quick release plate to the bottom of the camera with a quarter inch screw in the screw kit. Snap the adjustable placement guide onto the camera body before locking the screw. Follow the steps to install the camera in horizontal and vertical shooting modes. Move the lever on the mounting plate to the unlock position. Insert the lower quick release plate. And move the lever to the lock position after it is engaged. Move the lever on the lower quick release plate to the unlock position. Insert the upper quick release plate with the camera and move the lever to the locked position after it is engaged. To remove the camera from the lower quick release plate, move the lever to the unlock position and remove the camera while pressing the safety lock beside the lever. To remove the lower quick release plate, move the lever on the camera mounting plate to the unlock position and remove the lower quick release plate while pressing the safety lock on the mounting plate. Loosen the knob on the camera mounting plate and press the knob and safety lock at the same time. Then remove the gimbal horizontal plate, mount it vertically to the gimbal, and tighten the knob. During mounting, if the axis lever and knobs on either side of the mounting plate interfere with the camera cage, lift up the levers or knobs to reorient them. Adjust the balance of the tilt, roll, and pan axis according to the shooting requirements before using the gimbal. This ensures the stability of videos and the full performance of the gimbal. An unbalanced gimbal may affect the stability of videos and reduce the battery life. Severe imbalance may cause the device to overheat and go into hibernation. Balance the vertical tilt, the depth for the tilt axis, the roll axis, and the pan axis in sequence. Unlock the tilt axis. Rotate the tilt axis so that the camera lens is pointing upward. Check to make sure the camera is not top or bottom heavy. If top heavy, move the camera backward. If bottom heavy, move the camera forward. Loosen the mounting plate knob and move the mounting plate back and forth to adjust the center of gravity. Tighten the mounting plate knob while holding the camera upward. The vertical tilt is balanced when the camera is steady while pointing upward. Rotate the tilt axis so that the camera lens is pointing forward. Check to make sure the camera is not front or back heavy. If back heavy, move the camera forward. If front heavy, move the camera backward by turning the knob. 
Unlock the lever on the mounting plate and move the lower quick release plate back and forth to adjust the center of gravity. Move the lever on the mounting plate to the locked position. The tilt axis is balanced when the camera is steady while tilted up or down by 45 degrees. Lightly rest the axis arm and unlock the roll axis. Check the direction in which the roll motor swings. If the camera lens tilts or rotates in a direction, move the camera in the opposite direction, respectively. Unlock the lever on the roll axis, lightly rest the mounting plate, and move the roll axis arm to adjust the center of gravity. Move the lever on the roll arm to the lock position. The roll axis is balanced when the camera is steady horizontally. Lock the roll axis. Unlock the pan axis. While holding the grip, tilt the gimbal forward and rotate the pan arm until parallel with you. Check the movement of the pan axis. If the camera lens tilts or rotates in a direction, move the camera in the opposite direction respectively. Unlock the lever on the pan axis and move the pan axis arm to adjust the center of gravity. Toggle the lever on the pan arm to the locked position. The pan axis is balanced when the camera is steady when rotating the pan while tilting the grip. Unlock the tilt axis. Rotate the tilt axis so that the camera lens is pointing upward. Check to make sure the camera is not top or bottom heavy. If top heavy, move the camera backward. If bottom heavy, move the camera forward. Loosen the mounting plate knob and move the mounting plate back and forth to adjust the center of gravity. Tighten the mounting plate knob while holding the camera upward. The vertical tilt is balanced when the camera is steady while pointing upward. Rotate the tilt axis so that the camera lens is pointing forward. Check to make sure the camera is not front or back heavy. If back heavy, move the camera forward. If front heavy, move the camera backward by turning the knob. Unlock the lever on the mounting plate and move the lower quick release plate back and forth to adjust the center of gravity. Move the lever on the mounting plate to the locked position. The tilt axis is balanced when the camera is steady while tilted up or down by 45 degrees. Lightly rest the axis arm and unlock the roll axis. Check the direction in which the roll motor swings. If the camera lens tilts or rotates in a direction, move the camera in the opposite direction, respectively. Unlock the lever on the roll axis, lightly rest the mounting plate, and move the roll axis arm to adjust the center of gravity. Move the lever on the roll arm to the lock position. The roll axis is balanced when the camera is steady horizontally. Lock the roll axis. Unlock the pan axis. While holding the grip, tilt the gimbal forward and rotate the pan arm until parallel with you. Check the movement of the pan axis. If the camera lens tilts or rotates in a direction, move the camera in the opposite direction respectively. Unlock the lever on the pan axis and move the pan axis arm to adjust the center of gravity. Toggle the lever on the pan arm to the locked position. The pan axis is balanced when the camera is steady when rotating the pan while tilting the grip. Up to five uses without activating the gimbal are supported. After that, activation is required for further use. Press and hold the power button to power on your device. Enable Bluetooth on the mobile phone. Launch the Ronin app and log in with the DJI account. Select the device used, type in the default password, 
1234-5678 and activate the gimbal according to the instructions. If new firmware is available, users will be notified by the Ronin app. Tap Update Now to start firmware update. Press and hold the power button for two seconds to power on the gimbal and the three axes will unlock and expand automatically. Press and hold the M button and trigger to start automatic calibration.